Hello, and welcome to episode 50 of the Penguin Zoo podcast. Welcome to another iPad production. Um, funds went all funky from the last update. Can't get a cord for my iPad, or my MacBook. So, let's do this in 15 minutes. First, whips. I have a whip in my Stitch by Just a New Jane's hat bag. I love this bag. It is called Clark Gable. And it is a pair of cabled finger, uh, fingerless mittens that I got with my soapbox. It is pretty. I'm about halfway done, I think, the first one. It is on size 3.5 aluminum needles. And I really like it. Oh, the yarn is Lorna's laces. And ah! Sorry. Don't hit the space bar. Space bar problem. Okay, there we go. Good enough. Horrible lighting as always. Um, so it's Lorna Lace Laces. I'm not sure what. I'll look it up next time. I'm not sure who it's by. It's the soapbox. Um, other up is, I was knitting this and got a little carried away for my, uh, store picture. I might keep them. This is the Miho on MCN. The purple is not showing up right. It's a little more of a, um, a plummy purple. But it's real pretty. Love it. So, there's Miho. Super soft MCN. Uh, Plain Penguin Super Sock. So, I still need to do a pattern for that. I'll get to it. Um, 25 millimeter needles. What's next? I keep saying it. Our Narnia Tank when I get a chance to finish it. Uh, the Ginny Cardigan when I get a chance to start it. Narcissa Socks from the... Um, Ginny Cardigan and Narcissa Socks from the Harry Potter book magazine, unofficial mitts magazine when I get a chance to start those. And a new pair of Hopsalots. Those are next. I got the yarn. I'm doing a lighter pair. My old pair. Let me grab them actually. It's right here. One sec. Nope, not that one. Let's go with this. My old pair got a whole, don't mind the sweater. It's like gross and yucky and it was a dye day. So uh, yeah, they got this big hole. That's actually really massive and it would make a big lumpy thing if I just tried to fix it so I'm just gonna make a new pair but these are cute Ooh, on the floor so this is the only thing I bought recently is this from a store and that store actually uh, one of the people who works there really likes my yarn they are thinking about carrying it for color affection shawls in the summer which is awesome uh, one of the employees bought some yarn going to a knit night there that's all I have to say about that Cool stuff. The store my hair my yarn. How freaking cool is that? I'm gonna be in an actual shop. Also cool. Gem Baron manicure. It's about a week grown out. Um, gonna think of a cow. Not doing it yet. It'll probably start in April. So, shop stuff. I don't even know what time we're at because the lights where my timer is. Oh wait, let's do that. Three minutes. It's a really quick show. Okay, I talk fast. So I'll give you some. Sorry. Um. Well, now I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh yeah. So I have a plan of what I'm supposed to be doing every week. Work keeps changing. Um, now they're actually giving me hours. So every Tuesday I'm gonna try and do a blog post. Every Wednesday I'm gonna try and do a newsletter. Every Friday, every other Friday I'm gonna do an update. And every Sunday. I'm going to try and do a podcast. Uh, so this podcast is late. And I planned to do it Sunday. It just didn't happen. Let's not talk about it. I was busy or forgot or something. I just put it off. It was horrible. Um, so shop stuff. Every other Friday is going to be updates. So this Friday the 6th. Not the one after that. The next one after the 6th is going to be the 20th. February 20th. So keep in mind. Uh, I'm going to try doing BKNs again. Didn't get to do them this week. I don't know about next week, but it'll be during a weekday because I'm going to try and give myself weekends off. Um, clubs! I'm having a Firefly Club! Sign-ups are in March, ships out April, May, June. I'm pumped. Also, theme of the month comes back. Theme of the month starts in March. Game of Thrones. Can't wait for the show! Um, theme of the month for April, Outlander. Also love that show. Who's picking the themes? I'm picking the themes. I'm going to start a poll thing, though, because I want your opinions, too. 
I just needed to set something up and start planning. Sorry, I had an itch. Um, oh yeah, I didn't even show you guys this. I changed that one to a blue one so it sticks out. I've had that forever. And I changed it and I got this thing, but it's kind of really annoying and cheap and stupid. So I'm just trying to change it back to a ball. But it was kind of fun for a while. It sticks out all funny now. Um, time. So good. Um, yarn porn! So I'm having an update, so I'm going to give you guys a sneaky peeky so you can actually see the colors if it shows up. Yes, I said sneaky peeky. So, for... Oh, am I missing what? No, we're good. Okay, for Valentine's Day, since this is coming, we have Cupid's Arrow. So it's my self stripe in, pink, white, and red. It's got thin stripes of white, thick stripes, sorry, thick stripes of pink and red. And that's on my sparkle base. You can see the sparkles. I've got Shot Through the Heart. So thin stripes of black, thick stripes of pink and red, and it's on BFL because it seems a little more badass on BFL for some reason. Badass on BFL. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> sorry guys. I'm going to have, and now my watch begins. This is the variegated version of Night Gathers. Just a heads up. Loving the colors. So that one I'll like stripe and pool and flash. Uh, oh, for Valentine's Day I forgot this one. Zombody to love. Because... It's Valentine's Day, and who doesn't like zombies? Zombies need love, too. Zombody, too. I love this one, actually. It turned out really well. Then, also for Game of Thrones, we've got... You know not... Hold on. It's having a... Its strings are showing. There we go. Uh, you know nothing. Jon Snow. It's just you know nothing. But this is also on BFL. Because if you're part of the Night's Watch, you're going to be cold, you want something extra warm and extra hearty. BFL it is. We've got Applejack, which is lights, greens, dark greens, yellows, and red. All the colors of all the apples. I actually really like this one. It's really pretty. This is uh, true to color. Really hard to photograph. Kind of off a little bit. I've got self-striping Jasmine because it's... Oh, I don't even have her here. Because it's jasmine. So this one stripes thick stripe blue, thin stripe of gold black gold. So the same same um, thickness for gold black gold, thick stripe blue. I need to start knitting samples. I haven't had time. It takes a long time. I gotta take a picture of it. And it's a big pain in the arse. I'm trying to, yes, I said that weird. I'm trying to find a way to digitally do it. And uh, we're working on it. Next up, Wicked. Thin stripes of black, thick stripes of green and purple, so black, purple, black, green kind of a thing. Love it. Purple again. It's not a plummy purple for this one. It's a little dark. That's a bit better. It's super, super vibrant. This green isn't even... It, it pops. It's, it's green. It's like acid. It's awesome. And last but not least, we have Let It Go. This one stripes like wild style. So instead of the black for wild, no it is, okay. So the black, thin black, thick gray, thin black, thick blue, thin black, thick purple. So it's the only thin, thick, times three colors that I've got besides wild style. And it is on MCN and it is so soft and oh man, do I want to steal this. The blue, this isn't even half, it, it pops. It's ice poppy, amazingly blue. Nice purple, pretty gray, this, this isn't even like half the color it is. It, fantastically gorgeous and I want it you can't have it it's mine okay I think that's all I have for the super quick show we're at about nine minutes kept it nice and quick uh, I hope to have a better show next week I hope to ha actually have a show with this camera to see how it goes soon because I love my camera um, if you notice the pictures in the shop are way better uh, I think that's it so have a good night Happy crafting and see you next week. Bye.